Howdy, I'm Dale Brisby, expert on all things cowboy, and today we're going to talk about five ways to get started ranching, old son. Ah. The first way to get started ranching is to become a free feed hand. I want my interns to, be, to work really hard. I want them to hustle, old son. When they help me feed, they're hustling. You don't mind doing a little well digging to pay for your breakfast, do you, Dick? You could go work for free for anybody. But so we're gonna label this first one, like I said, a free feed hand, but really it's a, it's an intern. Hey intern, you forgot to shut that door. Go get them horses out of that barn. <laughs> and you can intern for a cow-calf operation, sale barn, a horse trainer. You can go to a feed lot. So what, what's the difference between a bull and a cow? You got to be why ready to they, learn. What? Why is there a puddle over there? Like why, why you gotta be ready to learn. Puddles and not water truck. That's the fun part about. Water nasty. It's the fun part about being an intern. You can learn things. Just don't no, be. An, I never understood why trees had thorns. Just don't I, be an idiot. We can still chop it down. Put that feed in that there trough, little son. There you go. Because it's hard to make money if you don't know anything. Whether you're gonna raise your own cows or work for somebody else, if you don't know nothing, they ain't gonna pay you. So start off at the bottom. We started from the bottom, now we're here. I think Drake was a rancher, wanted to be a rancher. That's where he got that song. Dale has given me the opportunity to fulfill my lifelong dream of being a feed hand, as well as learning how to run cattle. This is one of the, the easiest ways, I think, that you can get started doing your own ranching, and that is to be a horse trainer. Maybe in your step one of ranching, you interned for a horse trainer. Now it's time for you to grow up. Put on your big boy pants, start yourself an Instagram, um, top paying performance horses. Still breaking horses when there's plenty of gentle ones in this world. It's time to turn this bronc into a kid horse. First things first, desensitization. Whoa, bunny. Whoa, bunny. Bam, I'm a horse trainer. Now, I can turn myself into a clinician and teach other people. I'm now taking on interns. The third way to get started ranching, find yourself some lease country. I got 14 cows. Uh, mine are the black one. Mine are the... <laughs> Dale, my solids are stripes. This is probably where everybody thinks the money is. They see that somebody has some cows and they automatically mm. assume that that person is rich. I don't want to see that country. Boy, the bankers and lawyers all get. You see a lot of old men running some cows. That's because the cows, there's times of the year where they're very low maintenance. They take care of themselves. This is my lease pasture here. Um, I like to put my cows out here so they can eat on the grass. And uh, you know, it costs X amount a month per head, uh, per pair, not per head, because that would be crazy to pay for the cow that has the calf that's out here. That calf got grandfathered in, old man. I don't need to pay you for that. Anyway, cow calf, uh, yeah, I lease this place. So sometimes finding lease country can be harder than buying land because it's like grandfathered in. Some people will own lease country or run lease country for 30 years, it seems like. If you're in the right place at the right time, it can be done. It is not impossible. You just gotta know the right people and be ready, old son. I like to come out here and like, look at that right there. Look at that right there. That calf sucking on the teeth. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Who says breastfeeding in public is disgusting? That's, that's absurd. It's natural. <laughs> Lease land. Is that, uh, you, 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 you do that to get in the cattle work. The fourth way and my favorite way to get started ranching is to become a super puncher. <laughs> what you need to be a super puncher is a good truck, preferably four wheel drive, doesn't have to be, a good trailer, and when I say good, like tires are aired up. Give me your butt. 
<laughs> Hat, boots, spurs, last but not least, a pony. You need yourself a ranching unit. Where are my glasses? This is where super punchers shine. When somebody's looking for a day work cowboy, you hear that old trailer rattling down the driveway because here comes a super puncher. When you're super punching, you're gonna wanna close the calf's eyes with your knee. See how calm and collected he is right now? Like we're, we're both just resting. Whoa, the fifth way to get started ranching is uh, very simple. Uh, number five, part A, get rich and buy everything. I thought you'd own a railroad by now too, Jake. Go find a way to make a lot of money and then buy you some cows, buy you some land, buy the trailer, buy the horses, buy yourself a tack room, all of it. That is literally one way to get started ranching. And you don't even have to know anything about it because you're rich and it doesn't matter. If you lose money, it's okay. That's part A. Part B, marry someone that's rich. First he gets clear, then he gets rich. And him so dumb he can hardly walk through a door without bumping his head. You become their super puncher. Whether you're a guy or a girl, look out for a profession that rich people use as a tax write-off. Bear with me. They say to become a millionaire in ranching, start out as a billionaire. That means you gotta love it, old son. You got to love it. You can't just jump into this thinking that you're gonna go get rich. That's not what it's about. It's about the Instagram pictures and the Snapchats. That's what it's about. How many likes you get? How many shares you get? I was born great. I was born a super puncher. I was born a 90 point bull rider. Not everybody can do that. And that's okay. You can still be a cowboy. You can still be a rancher. You can still be a super puncher. The only thing is, you can't act like you know everything. All right, you've gotta be humble, like me. I'm humble, old son. You're welcome. Even the greats don't act like they know everything. I mean, I know absolutely all of it. Everything there is to know about it, I know it. And you don't see me acting like it. If you wanna get into ranching, come on in willing to learn. Come over here, I'll teach you. But jump in on one of these five ways on how to get started ranching, and you're sure to be a cowboy lickety split, old son. Also, learn Lonesome Dove line by line. That's number one, prerequisite. I'm Dale Brisby, and this has been How to Get Started Ranching. Pow pow, and on to the next one. My hair okay? I saw Tough Cooper do this one. You put it like that. That was terrible. They like to have coals about like this, right? No. Smaller the better. Look at that. Organization. Symmetry. Look at that. You know how many of them I can fit in a Rubbermaid storage bin now? It's tight of keeping right there. Whew.